once again for this beautiful morning. Lord, we could not ask for more. In fact, we are so full of gratitude that thus far we have brought the six, 65 women of God to graduate for Level 1 to 4. So thank you so much. Father, we pray that everything that we have learned from all your speakers, lecturers, oh God, will never be forgotten. But instead, oh Lord, it will be used to glorify their name and their own respective endeavors in the ministry. Father, we pray that you bless their family and you will also bless them and that everything that we are transpired, especially for the coming 2019 and beyond, they will use every talent. They will share what we, they have in their hands, oh God, and be, Lord, the instrument the mouthpiece of your glory and grace so that more and more people will be brought under the foot of the cross. Father, we thank you once again. Lord, we lift up thy name and please bless our speaker, Sir Amiel. We pray, God, that you bless all the participants, including all these, uh, the uh, concerted effort of all the lecturers like uh, Pastor Eric. And we pray, God, that you will always be with him. Father, we thank you once again. Fill this place with your Holy Spirit, O oh God. Not, Lord, not to entertain and not to make fun out of it, O oh Lord, but instead, Lord, we lift up, O oh God, for the level up, O oh Lord, of your women in this part of Kabite. And we pray, God, that you will bind us together as one family, Lord, not only to be a camaraderie, but we are sisterhood and brotherhood in Christ. And we pray, God, as we are waiting and even preparing ourselves for the coming of Jesus, oh God, help us to be faithful and true to you. That our grandest reunion will not only be on earth, but we can always, oh God, Lord, shout and sing the soul of Moses, the soul of the Lamb, and the heavenly kingdom that you are preparing to each one of us. Oh God, let it be that there is no such dissension. There is no pride. There is no, Lord, such that's negative attitude, Lord. But towards heading to heaven, we are preparing ourselves, oh God. Please use us to be a tremendous blessing for our family, community, and all the rest of our brethren. And may we as they graduate today, Lord Jesus, I pray, as a minister of the gospel, Father, I pray that you will empower us and empower us with your spirit. Speak to us, O oh God, as we listen to your chosen servant. And I pray, Father, in the last day of this earth history, Father, we pray that anything that in, in connects you with the ministry, Lord, you will use our women, Lord, start in our family, start in us, oh God, so that we become more contagious, contagious of love, contagious of forgiveness, contagious, oh Lord, of being sisters and brothers in the Lord, so that when the time comes, oh God, in the sisters' ages of eternity, we will always be with you, oh God, and Lord, want to hear from your lips, well done, well done, not only brothers, but sister in Christ, oh God, you will enter into my kingdom. Father, we thank you once again. We pray that we can always experience peace that passes all understanding. We can experience the joy that comes within. And above all, we experience the love of Jesus. In fact, Ellen White says in Step of Christ, page 103 to 104, Christ and you crucified should be the theme of every conversation, every contemplation, and even our joyful emotions like this. Thank you once again for even this privilege of Lord marching for Jesus and our marching is not only end on this earth, oh God, but marching on Zion. To you once again, we lift up every minor details of our activities just for today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.